Hello, I'm back. And our topic for today is about extracting square roots. Quadratic equation is in the standard form if it is equal to zero. Ax squared plus bx plus c equal zero, where a, b, and c are real number, and a is not equal to zero. A solution to such an equation is a root of the quadratic function. If the quadratic expression factors, then we can solve the equation by factoring. For example, we can solve 4x squared minus 9 equals 0. The factor of x squared minus 9 equals 0 are 2x minus 3 and 2x plus 3. Why? Why? Why we come up in these factors? Because 2 times 2 equals 4 x times x equals x squared and negative 3 times positive 3 equals negative 9. So, let's proceed to solve and let's find the value of x. 2x minus 3 equal 0. Let's proceed to 2x. We need to put the negative 3 on the other side of equal. Always remember, if you will transfer any number on the other side of an equal sign, the sign of the number will change automatically. So this negative 3 will be positive 3. So now... We need to remove the 2 because we are finding the value of x. So we have to eliminate the 2. We have to put here 2 and at the same time we have to put here 2. Cancel this, cancel this and we find x is equal to positive 3 over 2. Well, let's proceed on the other side. The other one, 2x plus 3 equal 0. Same procedure, 2x, let's move the, the 3 on the other side. It will be negative 3. And we have to, I, to remove, to eliminate the 2 because we are finding the, the value of x. So, x is equal negative 3 over 2. Remember that the two solutions are always be in positive, negative. And x is equal positive, negative 3 over 2. 2. We used positive negative sign to write the solution in a more compact form. So now let's proceed. Now I will give you alternative method that can be used easily to solve equation where b is equal to 0. Giving the form of a squared plus c equal 0. The equation 4x squared minus 9 equals 0 is in this form. 
So let's solve it first. We need to isolate the x. So we need to isolate the x squared. So 4x e squared equals 9. 9 because the negative it will be positive automatically if you transfer it on the other side of the equal sign. So now we need to eliminate the 4 and 4 here. So we will have here x squared equals 9 over 4. Now, how we can eliminate the square root sign? So we need to put the square root sign that x squared square root equals the square root of 9 over 4. So let's eliminate this and this. So we have x equals, what is the square root of 9? It is 3. What is the square root of 4? It is 2. So therefore, x is positive negative 3 over 2. Now, let's proceed to check. We need to check if our answer is right. Okay, so we have here 4 x squared minus 9 equals 0. The x is equal to positive negative 3 over 4. Wait. Wait. x, the value of x is positive negative 3 over 2. So, for what is the value of x? Ne negative 3, 2 squared minus 9 equals 0. So, 4, 3 times 3 equals 9 over 2 times 2 equals 4. Negative times negative will be positive and minus 9 equals 0. Let's eliminate the 4. The remaining will be 9 minus 9 equals 0. 9 minus 9 equals 0 equals 0. So our answer is correct. Let's also solve it in the if the 3 over 2 will be positive. 4x squared minus 9 equal 0. 4, what is the value of x? Positive 3 over 2 squared minus 9 equal 0. So therefore, 4 3 times 3, 9, 2 times 2 was 2, minus 9 equals 0. Ah, so sorry, it's 4. So, let's eliminate the 4. So, the remaining is 9 minus 9 equals 0. So, 0 equals 0. So our answer is correct.